This week, I'm going to be learning how to type faster on a keyboard. I started off by taking a typing test to see what my current typing speed was at. The average typing speed is around 50 to 80 words per minute, and I got a typing speed of 65 words per minute. It's an average typing speed, but I want to see if I can increase my typing speed. I'm trying to get at least 100 words per minute. That's my goal for the end of this video. I'm going to try to go from 65 words per minute to 100 words per minute, hopefully by the end of this video. I recently got a new keyboard which is a lot smaller than my previous one so I'm still not used to typing on this keyboard and it really affects my typing speed but I feel like after typing on this keyboard for a while I'll get used to it and it won't be a big deal anymore. I did some research online on how to type faster and I found a couple of helpful tips. First one was to fix your body posture. It actually does have an effect on your typing speed if you're slouched over. You want to make sure that you're sitting with your back straight and your elbows bent at an angle. It's also important to keep your shoulders, arms and your wrist muscles as relaxed as possible. This is going to make it easier for your fingers to flow over the keyboard. So to start off, you want to position your fingers on the home row. These are the keys that are in the middle of your keyboard. Your left hand goes over the F, D, S, A keys and your right hand goes over the J, K, L and the semicolon. This right here is the starting position and on every single keyboard there's lines that are on the F and J key. If you look really closely you can see lines that are on the F and J key. These lines are there to make it easier for people to find the starting position. You want to make sure you start with putting your index fingers onto the keys with the lines on them. That's going to be your starting position. The next method that I learned about was keyboard color schemes. This method helps you figure out which fingers should be pressing each key. So for example, your pinkies will only hit these keys on the keyboard, your ring finger will only hit these keys, your middle finger only touches these keys, your index finger on these, and your thumb rests on the spacebar. And you can hit the spacebar with whichever thumb you feel comfortable with, it doesn't really matter. Now this may seem a bit awkward at first, but once you get used to it, it makes your typing so much faster. I also went on this website, which has a bunch of free lessons on it that teach you how to type faster on a keyboard. They use this touch typing method that I learned on that website. I'm going to leave a link to that website in the description so you guys can check it out if you want to go through the lessons as well and learn how to touch type. So I practiced on this website and I went through all of the lessons. After completing every single lesson that was on the site, I went back and redid the typing test to see if there were any improvements. And I was surprised to find that after doing the typing test, my speed came up to 104 words per minute. That's an increase of almost 40 words per minute. I was really happy to see how much my typing speed had improved and I did the typing test again to see if the results were accurate and on my second attempt I got 103 words per minute. So I was able to reach my goal of getting a typing speed of 100 words per minute and I was able to accomplish this in only two days. It took me two days to increase my typing speed up by almost 40 words per minute. So if you want to increase your typing speed, really all you have to do is just spend some time just typing. I recommend that you use the site that I used and you go through all the lessons. I guarantee you that your typing speed will go up drastically and it only takes a couple of days of practice. I'm a lot more used to typing on my new keyboard now as well and I actually enjoyed the process of learning how to properly type on a keyboard. If you guys enjoyed watching this video please leave a like and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos that are like this. You can also follow me on my Instagram if you want to see what I'm doing behind the scenes. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and I'll see you guys next week with another skill.